what's up it is saturday afternoon it's two o'clock it's halloween i cleaned the apartment this morning and made breakfast and that's about it and i finally just change into different clothes other than the clothes that i was um wearing to sleep in and christian and i went to bed super late last night we were watching a show called the night of on hbo max i think because we have that channel and we were watching that i had like two coffees this morning maybe i'll have another coffee because we're going to hang out with some friends tonight to celebrate halloween that's a kind of diy my costume which will be fun i have to go over to my dad's house because he has a glue gun so i'm gonna do that today but i wanted I'm, me and christian are going as a bloody bride and groom and um i found here so this is exactly what I was envisioning when I went to the Halloween store. This is like the exact outfit that I had in mind. This is the costume that I picked up. Obviously, I'm not wearing that belt that says boy toy on it. And it only came with the skirt, the gloves, and the necklaces. So I got this costume and I cut the skirt because the skirt was really long. So I cut it and I have this, I was just going to wear like a white top and call it a day but i think i'm gonna get creative and since i cut some of the fabric off of the skirt i got a ton of it off the skirt and i think i'm gonna like super glue it or sew it onto just a plain white bralette top that i have that i never wear so it's so fine but i've kept it and then i went to joann's and got like this plain fabric like this and it's gonna be my veil and then I got some pearls and I got some shorts from these are really short but it's gonna be worn under the skirt I got some shorts to wear under the skirt from Party City me and Christian went last night to Party City and was like rushing around and I almost bought a tutu but then I found this costume which I would never wear so this on, since I have so much of this extra fabric from the skirt, yeah, but that's my costume. And then we got some fake blood. It's funny how they had a costume that I could just kind of like DIY and make my own into exactly what I was like envisioning because I didn't want like a full on tutu because they literally stick out like this and it looks really ballerina-y. I think this is perfect for like a bride and Christian already has like pants and like a button up and stuff like that and all we have to do is just smear blood on us and then we're good to go. I'm going to my dad's house right now to DIY my costume for tonight. It's two o'clock, Christian's watching the UCF game. My hair, my hair looks absolutely insane. I can't brush it when it's natural because it makes it super poofy. So I really haven't brushed it. I like put dry shampoo in it, but. It's um, my dishwasher. But anyways, it's um, 9.30. Is that the actual time? Because it was, it was daylight savings. Yes, it's 9.30. So I'm going to, let's make my coffee. I haven't had my coffee yet today. So let's make that. Let me get something for you to stand on. Okay, I'm just going to make my coffee really quick. And then I'll talk to you. Because I, should I do a double shot of espresso? I can't believe I finally filled up my bag of espresso pots. Like I can't believe I'm already on another bag. Sorry I didn't vlog too much yesterday. I was running around trying to get ready um, to go to dinner. We went to dinner with some of Christian's old roommates that he was living with for a few years. Um, before we signed this lease together so it was nice to get basically like everyone back together we took a few photos last night using my ring light and I'll probably insert a few um, right here
Christian is at, he's playing flag football this morning with some of his friends. So I think I'm going to go to the grocery store. I need just some lunch stuff. So I think we have basically enough stuff for dinner this week, but I do buy my lunches every single week. But yeah, good morning. It is actually morning. It would be 10.45 because of daylight savings, but 9.45. I don't know if this whole entire time you could see. So we, Christian and I were a dead bride and groom. So we put the fake like wound that we got from Spirit Halloween on our forehead and like on our bodies. Then we put the fake blood on our skin and it kind of left like a stain. I was like scrubbing my forehead last night with um like my cleansing balm like my makeup remover cleansing balm and i was like this is barely even doing anything so i don't know if you could see i was doing my makeup this morning i could still see some of the redness and i don't think it's really covering up so so if you saw my video where i went literally crazy in the nespresso store and bought so many pods then you know i got um, a few coffees to try. I got pumpkin spice cake, um, caramel cookie, and then I also got, well, it's hazelnut muffin, but that's what it, I don't even know how to say that. Of course, mixed it with like my all-time favorite, which is the this one. It's really good with the oat milk that I drank. I don't know if this is the best oat milk for you. Probably not, but I just get um, the original. Oatly oat milk. I think it tastes really good with um, all my pods. If you guys drink Nespresso coffee, what do you do? You put creamer in it? Do you put something else in it? I feel like these pods are obviously they have flavor in them, but I feel like it's such a dull flavor that I don't know. Like, am I missing something? Do I need to add more? What do you guys do if you drink the pumpkin spice cake and the caramel cookie and hazelnut muffin? Do you guys mix in? The coffee pods i feel like it's almost missing something i don't know because it makes me not like them that much you get what i'm saying like i feel like it's missing something so i need to add something it's like the oat milk isn't complementing them well i don't know you guys want to leave a comment down below on what you guys mix in with your coffee pods that's my little dilemma if you could help me out <laughs> It is a lot later in the day. I probably look exhausted. Um, I've been watching The Haunting of Bly Manor, which has the same actors as The Haunting of Hill House, and it's good. I'm only on episode, I'm about to start episode three. It's not as scary to me as The Haunting of Hill House. I feel like The Haunting of Hill House has a lot of like jump out scary scenes in it, and this one, doesn't it's freaky but i'm also watching it during the day and the haunting of hill house i feel like i watched it at night so maybe that has something to do with it i don't know and then i made banana bread which is my favorite and the apartment now smells amazing i love that banana bread um recipe it's so good and it's gluten free and dairy free right now i am about to see maya and taylor i'm going to a hole in the wall mexican restaurant with them and um it's called la fiesta it's just a cheap restaurant mexican restaurant it's probably delicious it's really early it's only 5 40 and we're meeting there at six, so that's what I'm doing. Didn't really do much else. I did some laundry today. Um, Christian and I also watched um, The Night Of. We've been watching a show called The Night Of on HBO Max, and we watched another episode of that, so I'm currently like watching two episodes. I mean, two different, 
series on one's on Netflix and one's on HBO Max. Take me to La Fiesta. Getting directions to Boca Fiesta. Boca Fiesta, no. No, that's literally how far away is that? No, that's two and a half hours away. Celebrate the birthday on Friday because the Friday is like our day where we're off and not doing anything. Okay, I just had to blow dry my hair because it's pouring outside. Can we, here, let me turn the camera around. I had to walk to my car in the rain and I want my hair to look semi-decent because tomorrow Chris and I are going to dinner. There's some family coming into town, so we're going to dinner tomorrow and I want my hair to just like be okay. <laughs> so dry again. But anyways, yeah, I just got home. Um, it's 7.30, Christian's out here. He went, my hair is poofy. He went to dinner with um, a friend. But anyways, I just wanted to end off this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, yeah and i have to get ready for work tomorrow but thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye